was always interested in science ever since elementary school. I was always fascinated about how things work. I decided to become an inorganic chemist during my high school senior year. I had an opportunity to become a student intern at Sandia National Laboratories. Nanomaterials are very small. They're smaller than a single strand of your hair. They're very exciting to study their electronic and their magnetic properties. Some materials can glow in the dark. As a chemist, I get to go into the laboratory and synthesize or make these nanomaterials using chemicals. In order to become a scientist, make it a goal to go to college and get an education in science or in engineering or even math.